Yo, it's Guido coming at you with a Tactics Talk. First look, for those of you who are new and haven't seen one of these, I have not seen this video or this replay. We have LP Bronco and his T-50-2. Tier 6 Russian light tank. He's in an all Tier 6 battle. Something you don't really see. Spawned in, it looks like Westfield, and he spawned down into the southwest. He goes up to the bottom of this hill, or the edge of this hill, which can be a nice spot, potentially, if he gets lights on the guys over on the east side looks like he's got a 178 Bravo headed up that way. A couple other lights going. And look at these two Thunderbolts cruising along down through the middle. That's something you don't see very much. They're platooned. They're going to drive right up the middle. Very strange. Usually that part of the map is almost never used. Potentially late game as a way to run through. A little bit of gunnery problems right there. And that looks... Well, that's a hit. Auto-aim there. Yeah, I don't know if I would auto-aim there, LP. That, all those shots are going to go behind. The one actually hit him, which was interesting. But they're getting lit, I guess, by the Thunderbolts. The T-50-2, the other one, is over on the southeast side. But they've kind of gobbled up the tanks that were up there. It looks like it was only the 178 Bravo. And now they're pushing the T-50-2 back. But those guys look like they're continuing to poke over and try to take on the Thunderbolts. And that is an interesting... You don't see that very often on this map. Very strange, but it is one of the reasons why this spot is a decent decent spot if you have the lights to shoot across. You can also light up guys or push into like the 12T right there, but for the moment, it looks like LP is content to just farm damage from the middle here. He's got some gold going on to push through the larger, heavier tank there. Shot goes into the into the rock, another shot, and this tank shoots really fast. Looks like he's tracked the T-3045, but the T-3045 fixes it. However, for his troubles, he leaves with 38 hit points. Now there's an A-43 moving through, a little lead fire. Ooh, just barely caught the back of him. He probably needed a little bit more lead. Same thing, but that time tracked him as well. Holy cow, he fixes it. He's just taking a pummeling. Just taking a pummeling. What's going on the rest of the map? Looks like they're holding their own up in the north, although it looks even better now that the O1 one just died as I was talking about it. But they're losing. Holy cow, he got spotted. So somebody got close enough. Maybe the Su-100 saw him right there, and now he's just running for his life. Look at all the shots that came in. And that's because they completely own that east side of the map. 12T maybe saw him coming down the middle. Somebody was able to get in there. He was so busy, so channelized shooting those guys, he didn't really see him. Another auto aim shot, but that's amazing. There we go. Now we're zoomed in. Oh, that missed. And now we're spotted. Look out. Be careful. Wow, we're really just relying on that auto aim. It's worked out for the most part. And now we've got a 13 or 178 Bravo, and it nails him with HE on the run. That's what those tanks can do. LP's running for his life. And it looks like the wheeled tank has broken off and moved back. And LP's team is losing. The KB-2 kind of held his own up there, but looks like that east push just gobbled up the two Thunderbolts and everything else that attempted to go over there and fight him. Down goes the Krom one as well. To be honest, I don't know if he wins or loses this game. He said it was an ace, so let's see what happens here. Is this an epic ace and a loss, or does he bring this thing back? 1,117 damage, 308 spotting. He's going to switch what he's doing and come up here. He's got a nice gun on the 100Y. Hellcat's a capable tank. He has an M44 artillery, which is good, but it looks like the artillery's maybe in trouble. There's another shot. Man, I really think you need a little more lead fire. Oh, yeah, there it was. <laughs> and we're just about out of our gold rounds. We've really been flinging those liberally. We've only got one left, and we're going to have to go to regular AP. There's a 100. Gets the Hellcat. That's a, that's a tough one. The Hellcat should have never stayed right there. Especially since that whole side collapsed. It's extremely exposed. Once he's seen, he's done. And the M44, told you, it's a capable artillery. And he survived that push by the A43. But here comes the wheel tank now. Looks like we're going to react to that. So LP swings back around and see if he can take him on. And we had two M44s. Did not realize that. He gets shotgunned. He gets shotgunned, and does that cost them an M44? It doesn't look like it does. It does not cost them an M44. LP comes up to this bush. He's got that nice camo, but he's slit. Oh, and he gets a shot in him as he's running backwards. Dives down. Oh, 100Y <laughs> munches the 3485M. And here comes the other one. Coming up the hill, LP. And down he goes to the 100Y. Don't call it a comeback. We've been here the whole time. 
Now is he going to go look for the other 100Y? There's an AT8 over there, a 3045M that's on a one shot. I don't remember where the 40TP ended up, but he finds the other 50-2. And this is not good, because he doesn't have a lot of hit points. And the 50-2 and the enemy artillery are tearing up that poor guy. Another shot into him with auto aim. Holy cow. Looks like he's going to push out of the town, maybe. Yeah, he probably doesn't want to stick around here. The 3045M is looking at him. Potentially. Wow, they're really getting pushed now. The enemy team is coming in from every direction. LP's going to head down here and maybe looks like he's trying to help his artillery. But that AT-8 is right there. Those things shoot fast. Another auto-aim shot in the 50-2. Another one. The 100Y crushes him. Holy cow, look at this. Now they're ahead. Now they are ahead. Where's the 40 TP? That guy could really make a difference if he showed up. We're just tracking him now. Really could use that... Really could be using that uh, gold right now. And the 100Y rams. Rams to death. The AT-8. Looks like he's going to sacrifice himself potentially. Yes, he does. To get rid of the armored AT-8. Now, where's that 100Y? It's very possible he is still sitting up in a bush. Kind of depends on the type of player he is. But it looks like LP's coming down here. And the 304 is thinking, I am out of here. Here comes LP looking for some auto-aim action. Holy cow, he's chasing this poor guy down. See how it's following him, at least on the replay? You got to watch out for that when you have any kind of line of sight. 304 has no chance. He's done. And LP is... Re oh, he finds the 40 TP. He gets a light on him. Artillery starts working on the 40 TP. He decides not to face that guy up. That's a good idea because he will just one-shot lap LP. And LP's going to come around here. And where is the World Wonders? Where is the Su-100? Why? Look at him clicking. The Su-100Y is clicking on LP. LP's like, dude, I am aware of where the 40 TP is. <laughs> All right, Wonder. Well, I'll give you that. You did a nice job in there, helping him come back. But uh, stop clicking. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, did he? He. Oh. Okay. Well, folks, that was RNG at work. A bounce. The 40 TP bounced a shot off of LP Broncos 50-2. You know when you have these epic games like this. That's the kind of thing that happens. You get a couple of those good breaks, you're able to leverage those, and it turns into an epic ace mastery game. What a comeback by LP. Let's see if we can close this thing out and stay alive. Like I said, I don't know. I didn't even really pay attention to the results that he sent me. I just, oh, look at this. He found the one, founds. He found the 100Y, but he bounces the 100Y, misses his shot. <laughs> and it has a really long reload. It's gonna take three shots for LP. He just keeps moving. Oh, 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 oh. This could be trouble. Oh, another bounce off the front. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> what a turn of events. What a turn of events. Now he's got to track down the M44. And will he get shotgun? Is he going to get the fourth kill? The fourth kill and another, what, 300 hit points or so, potentially, or 200 hit points? Now, the M44 was not in the bushes over there when he came off the hill. So he's repositioned somewhere. Did he go up the hill, or is he actually hiding down around here somewhere? I'd be surprised. He probably would have shot at LP. There he is. He's way up top. He's not going to survive the KV-2, I don't think. So LP's not going to get that damage. Let's see. Is the K What's the KV-2 doing? Just go kill him there, fella. Oh, my gosh. You got <laughs> there it is. That's what I thought was going to happen a lot sooner than that. Wow, man. Nice job. 2,100 damage in a Tier 6 light tank. 1,141 Spotting in 270, <laughs> 270 bounce. That was that big hit, really, that broke it open for the team when the 40 poor 40 TP bounced off LP's tank. Thanks for sending that in, guys. I appreciate that, guys. LP, guys. And for everybody else, thanks for tuning in. As always, I appreciate your support, and we will see you.